tomorrow comes, I'll be on my own Feeling frightened of the things that I don't know When tomorrow comes, tomorrow comes, tomorrow comes And though the road is long, I look up to the sky And in the dark I found a lost that I won't fly And I sing along, I sing along, I sing along I got all I need when I got you and I I look around me and see a sweet life I'm stuck in the dark but you're my flashlight You're getting me, getting me through the night Can't stop my heart when you're shining in my eyes Can't lie, it's a sweet life I'm stuck in the dark but you're my flashlight You're getting me, getting me through the night Flashlight, you're my flashlight, you're my flashlight. I see the shadows long beneath the mountain top. I'm not afraid when the rain won't stop. Cause you light the way, you light the way, you light the way. I got all I need when I got you and I I look around me and see a sweet light Stuck in the dark with you my flashlight You're getting me, getting me through the night Can't stop my heart when you're shining in my eyes Can't stop, it's a sweet light I'm stuck in the dark with you my flashlight You're getting me, getting me through the night I'd like to thank everybody for coming. Join us in this wonderful celebration. Uh, I know many of you came from far away and we do appreciate your sacrifice and your care for these two. Bless you. <laughs> so yeah, we wanted to thank you guys for coming. Um, and I kind of want to just share exactly what this means. Um, we have embarked on a journey and we started this journey a few years ago um, together knowing that God had a path for us and a plan for us didn't know how things were going to work out didn't really expect it to happen but what we did know was that whatever journey that we were going on together God was going to provide people around us friends and family that we wanted to share this journey with and that's you guys we wanted to do a wedding that wasn't just about Jocelyn and I, and it wasn't just about a ceremony, and it wasn't just about, you know, tradition. We want to do a wedding that is a celebration, but it's also an invitation. An invitation to walk with us, to live with us, not in our house. <laughs> um, but to do life with us, and we want to do life with you. And as we do life and follow God on this path, we're very thankful that you are here to, to share this with us, and um, we really appreciate it. So welcome to what we call Flashlight Journey, and you'll hear more about what that means to us as we go on. the honor of starting. <laughs> I stand here in awe, in awe of God's love, in awe of the orchestration of our lives that has brought us to this point, in awe of your unconditional love for me, in awe that I could feel this kind of love in my lifetime. Growing up, I often dreamed of what the man I would marry would be like, who he would be, and what his life was like. I had a pretty good idea of what I wanted, and the man I would spend my life with, 
and that idea grew bigger and bigger the passing years. But realistically, I figured that all those qualities couldn't be found in one person, so I thought I would have to compromise. God proved me wrong. Not only do you encompass every desire, but you exceed every idea of what I had of the man I would marry. You are my perfectly imperfect match, a man not afraid to be who God has called him to be. We both have had pretty epic lives as single people, filled with service, people, and experiences. Lives that made an impact as we were. So going into this marriage, although we become one, I don't view you as a better half, but as a completing whole. Another whole person who complements who I am and will help drive my passions, dreams, and love for God to a totally different level. You have motivated me to be more sensitive, decisive, strong, and open-minded. And together as a team, I know we will be that and much more. You lift me up when I'm down. You're always an optimist when I'm being too much of a realist. You bring balance to my highs and lows in a way no one has ever done. Being on a team with you means there will be crazy highs, deep lows, and interesting plateaus. But with my best friend in front of me, I know we can do it all. Loving you was an, a choice. A quiet step into an ocean whose waves I embraced long before I could ever share what you even meant to me. You walked into my life at one of its darkest and scariest moments and have been a continual pillar of strength from that day forward. Your friendship, vulnerability, prayers, and corny sense of humor started a journey I pray never ends. I chose to love you for who you were that first day and each day I find myself in love with you deeper still. I don't want you to change a thing about yourself, yet I know change is a part of life, and I can't wait to be in love with the person you will be tomorrow. Ari Christopher, you have shown me what love feels, acts, and looks like. You have never required anything of me while giving me all of yourself. I gave you my heart and made the commitment to spend my life with you a long time ago. But today, this is my solemn vow to you, my love to respect and cherish you, to join you in keeping Christ the center and forefront of our relationship, to always be your biggest supporter and ally, to pursue um, dreams and God's calling on our lives with you, to pray with you, to forgive and be patient, to care for you and always worry about you, to be honest and faithful and to love you unconditionally until the end of our time on this earth and to greet each new adventure, good, bad, great, or small, by your side. For from this day forward, you shall never walk alone. For my heart shall always be your home, and my arms your shelter. I love you no matter what. Jocelyn. <laughs> I told you I wasn't gonna write any vows because I wanted to speak from the heart. And for a moment, I was actually thinking I might have a problem doing that, like after I heard your vows, but now that I'm standing here and just looking at you, it's easy as I don't know. <laughs> so several years ago, I was laying in a field, looking at the stars with some friends at camp. I remember one of my friends saying, can you just imagine, just think, it just takes one little tiny light to extinguish darkness. And I look at my life now and realize that God had planned so many lights in my life, but there was one North Star that he wanted in my life, a huge part of it. So when we first started dating, I told you that I viewed our relationship as a triangle. I viewed you on one side, me on the other, and you got at the top. Three lights on this journey. Me, I never thought I would have the, <laughs> the love that, that I, I'd seen many people have, the one that I wanted to dream about and, and that would just make me feel like God had just created her for me. And then I got to know you, you, the second part of this equation. And I got to know the person with the kindest heart, 
selfless heart, one who thinks about people for herself, one who cares genuinely about people, one who, who mothers, but is also a sister and a best friend. And as I got to know you, the more I realized I don't want to do life without you. The more that I realized, God, you actually created a light in my life that I would carry for the rest of my life. God, the third part of this equation. And he has given me the desire to make this vow to you. Jocelyn, I vow to be the husband that God desires me to be for you. I vow to cherish you. I vow to uplift you. I vow, I vow to, to be your peace when you have storms that come into your life. I vow to be that smile that shows upon your face when you need it the most. I vow to be that shoulder, strike that. I vow to be the loving arms that surround you when you feel like crying. I vow to always strive to lead you closer to God, knowing that as I'm going up that path, that side of the triangle, the closer we get to God, the closer we get to each other. I vow to love you. I vow to love you as Christ loves the church. I vow to love you no matter what. Unconditional. Love never fails. So my vow to you is this. I told you before. And I told your parents too. I don't, I don't need you. I want you. I choose you. I love you with all of my heart forevermore.